The jury in the George Zimmerman trial came back with a not guilty verdict late last night. And as Marcy Gonzalez explains, that doesn't necessarily mean his troubles are now over. We, the jury, find George Zimmerman not guilty. George Zimmerman is a free man. Your GPS monitor will be cut off when you exit um, the courtroom over here, and uh, you have no further business with the court. The 29-year-old in court smiling, acquitted of manslaughter and second-degree murder, avoiding the potential of life in prison. I think the prosecution of George Zimmerman was disgraceful. I am gratified by the jury's verdict. The verdict coming after 16 hours of deliberations, 17 months after Zimmerman killed Trayvon Martin. Zimmerman maintained he shot the teen in self-defense. The jury now agreeing the shooting was not a crime. Justice for Trayvon! Justice for Trayvon! Here outside of the Seminole County Courthouse, demonstrators reacted to the verdict peacefully, some with frustration Murder is a crime. and support for Trayvon Martin's parents, who were in court every step of the way for this nearly month long trial, except for last night. Too emotional, their attorney says, to sit in the room as the verdict was read. Um, we are very, very, very um, saddened, um, but we accept the jury's verdict um, in this case. Um, first and foremost, um, on behalf of Tracy Martin and Sabrina Fulton, um, who are just heartbroken. Although Zimmerman was acquitted, Martin's family would still have the option to file a civil wrongful death lawsuit. Marcy Gonzalez, ABC News, Sanford, Florida.